Well, my life goal is to be obsessed with Jesus Christ. An obsession is almost always destructive. But there's one obsession that is liberating, that will bring us into our destiny. It will fill us with spiritual pleasure. It will make our spirit fascinated. Christianity is much more than an escape from Christianity. It's much more than obeying a code. Christianity is actively pursuing a person, not just escaping trouble, not just having a successful life. It's actively pursuing and encountering a person who's fully God and fully man. I want to give you a vision. For the revelation of Jesus, the Magnificent One. He is the Magnificent One. Philippians 3.8, I count all things lost. In other words, I'll give up everything. Why? For the excellence of the knowledge of Christ Jesus. Paul said, I gave up everything because I wanted more of the excellency, the magnificence of Jesus. I wanted to feel more, see more, encounter more, understand more. I will remove everything that gets in the way that I can encounter more of Him. Lord, if I can see what Paul saw, I can live dedicated like Paul lived. Because without seeing more, there's no way I would give myself more to Him. The Holy Spirit, He knows more about Jesus than you can imagine. And He wants to reveal Him to your spirit in a greater way. Are you hungry for more? For real? The Spirit gives us more of Jesus based on hunger. Are you hungry for more? The most powerful, the most pleasurable reality anyone can experience is the knowledge of God, the magnificence of Jesus. I am basing my life on that point. I've committed my life to that truth. The most neglected subject in the kingdom of God is God. There are a million voices in our nation that are preaching on evangelism how to get saved. There are a million voices telling us about healing. I like that. I'm one of them. There are a million voices telling us that we can transform society. There's a million voices talking about how Jesus will give us more money, believing for prosperity. There are very few voices in the land talking about the deep things of his heart. The great need in the body of Christ is to encounter Jesus in His magnificence. So much of the body of Christ is living spiritually bored with a dull, defiled spirit. They're bored with Jesus. We need preachers, teachers, singers, musicians that are going deep in the revelation of the majesty of who this man is. And it won't happen on the run. It won't just come automatic. Proverbs chapter 2. If you receive my word, if you treasure my word, if you incline your ear, cry out for more discernment or more revelation, seek for her as silver, then you will understand the fear of the Lord. Then, you will find the magnificence of the excellence of the glory of Christ Jesus.